Also, let's just head back here real quick and let's see if we can catch a Pokemon that knows cut. A slugma. Interesting. All right, slugma move set. Pokemon Crystal. No, I can't learn cut. No one can learn cut. This is so frustrating. All right, let's go take on all the trainers at Fuchsia City Gym, and then we'll go on to the next town. That's what we're doing. We're just unlocking all the cities so that then we can just fly around to them. Training up our Pokemon, and then we'll try to wreck all the gym leaders. Hopefully wreck all the gym leaders. We'll see. And then we'll face red. I do think we can finish this today, possibly. I do think that's a possibility. I think we can finish this challenge today. That would be really nice. Earthquake will still kill this thing, right? There we go. Oh, so close. Alright. If it's just gonna do that, then we're just gonna throw in a Pona and just use Fire Blast, because I'm gonna assume that Venusaur is next. Seems like a safe assumption. You're going to throw in a Bulbasaur and then an Ivysaur, and then you have one Pokemon left. Hit Fire Blast, though. There we go. Level 54, let's go. And as is expected, there's the hoss itself. Just a little bit of a trial for when we face red. Yeah, I know I'm not weak. Oh, I can actually see the outlines. Well, I don't want to like accidentally talk to the actual gym leader. What? Which one's actually the gym leader? All right, whatever, we'll come back here and we'll just, this will be the one place where we have to face all the trainers. Cause I don't want to face the gym leader yet on accident. So let's just heal up real quick and let's go on to the next town. We have a full roster guys, we have six Pokemon. Granite Brain Cat's not gonna really do much at the moment.
the safari zone. Did they get rid of the safari zone for the bug catching contest that we didn't participate in? Or do you have to use cut? Because we can't. <laughs> can't believe how much of this game is inaccessible still. You'd think they would realize that you're probably not going to have a lot of cut Pokemon. New area! New area, new Pokemon. Stop with your Voltorbs. There we go. Magnemite. Nothing to worry about. God, Cube has been such a welcome addition. Yeah, he should be good enough to take on Lieutenant Surge without an issue, hopefully, by the time we get there. Obviously, we'll never be able to outspeed anything he has. But as long as we can tank hits, we're good. I guess that is a big ask. We're gonna need Cube to tank like five or six hits. A Magneton? Magnetone? Magnetonesis. Interessante. It locked on. I I'm spooked. JK. Sorry, Mom, I was beaten. It's horrifying. that to uh let's just own water boy ice punch <clears throat> let's go Kazam? Alaka Dam! Damn! Oh, it looks all fucking swollen and tough. But we still just killed it with one bite. Welcome back, Sam! Until your next meeting. What a busy businesswoman. Well, I gotta say, we're three hours and 15 minutes in, and we have had zero frames drop. So I don't want to say you helped me fix my problem, but we haven't gone three hours without a drop frame since I've had this issue. So I think you might have done it. I think you might have solved the issue. Today's back-to-back -back meeting, so annoying, I'm sorry to hear that. Woohoo, I'm really happy it got fixed. So am I. This has been marvelous to see that the, that it's zero. Yeah, crossing fingers, me too. I'm not going to say we're like in the clear yet, but we have not gone this long without it happening. Like by far. I don't think I've gone past two hours. It's usually about a half hour before it starts happening. So the fact that it hasn't happened in three 
Almost three and a half? That's fucking good news. I probably could have killed Cubone with Cube, but we'll just use Big Snake so that we can get a nice uh, waterfall off the bat in a nice possibly, no, it won't be level 42, but we'll be a little closer to level 42. I didn't want to lose. No one wants to lose. But you did. Oh, there's so many trainers here. What I imagine is that the malware was getting CPU or GPU busy from mining or similar. It does seem like that was what it was. You do seem to be correct in that thought process. And I appreciate you dearly for helping me figure that out. Because I don't know if I would have on my own, as you could tell by how defeated I was the other the other day. Last night. So thank you. Thank you so much. Was it just me a bunch of Parises? A bunch of Parases? fly or thunder punch thunder punch one hit KO eight badges that's great it's more than eight badges we defeated the elite four already we're in Kanto we're just strengthening up our team, visiting all the cities so that we can just fly one by one and take all the, the Kanto badges in just a swift swoop. Ooh, a ditto, that's kind of cool. <clears throat> so yeah, this run has been, has turned. It's made a very positive turn. Things are going very well. Now our only issue is gonna have to be dealing with red at this point. You know, I'm not worried, like, I'm worried that we'll still lose a Pokemon along the way, but I'm not worried that we can get to red. We can definitely get to red at this point. Can we beat him, is the question. God, why are there so many trainers? Whatever, we gotta fight them all, it's the rule. Clefairy? A cute little Clefairy. Let's punch it in the face. Have a good meeting. Alright, another trainer down. Hopefully this is the last trainer. They're on a field trip, that's why. That's why there's all these kids and teachers. Because they're on a field trip. And they're like, let's spend half the field trip just standing here waiting for wandering ten-year-olds to battle. Bellsprout, I miss suck plant. Rest in peace, suck plant. Remember suck plant, guys? He was so good. Suck plant was a great part of the team, and I miss I miss him dearly. A weeping bell? Sounds like that's right off Opponent's Alley. 
Rip to the suck. Hell yeah. See, we could have had one of these. We would have a victory bell by now. Oh, we would have grass type coverage. Mmm. Mmm, that would have been a zesty combo. I'm just happy that we're not all water Pokemon anymore. Because that was getting a little worrisome. Damn, this kid's got all three. He's got the entire evolutionary line. What a spoiled child. All right, hopefully that's it now. Wait, this is a different route? These are two routes? Two opportunities? For fresh new pokes? Oh my god, why are there so many trainers? Alright, well let's see. Let's see what's let's see. Hopefully it's something that can learn cut. A hop it. Can a hop it learn cut? Hop it, learn set, gen two. Uh -huh. Nothing knows cut. I want a Pokemon that can cut me out of danger. All right, hold on. I'll face you, kid. Don't worry. All right, let's battle. Bird Pokemon, huh? It should be a shame if someone punched them with the elements of ice. Alright, and then what's your other bird? Another Fero? What a weak little weakling. I fear no Pharaohs. See? Fucking wrecked. Just get fucking wrecked. Suck a butt, Bird Keeper Roy. All right, creepy old man, what do you want? You had a hard time catching your prized Pokemon. All right, let's see, let's see. What is your prized Pokemon? Pray tell. Pokefan Carter. A Bulbasaur? A Bulbasaur? You think I'm scared of your little baby Bulbasaur? I've got an Ice Punch Water Boy. You don't survive that shit. <laughs> it's level 29, I'm just being way over cocky. Uh, yeah, Thunder Punch is probably our best option for a little Squirtle. Oh, you're so cute! I got my little Squirtle. I know the green screen is warping it, but I got my little Squirtle right here. I'm gonna hold it while I kill your Squirtle. Steel Squirtle? I've got my own! I got my Squirtle right here! And mine survived! My Squirtle's still alive! Ha 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 ha! Blastoise's goat? Squirtle's better. Squirtle's goat. Charmander, cha, 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 cha. Well, let's just earthquake it. Let's just wreck his adorable Pokemon.
No mercy. Cuber Kai shows no mercy. Alright, are we almost at the next town? And this is a different route than this? We can't... Can we get there? Okay, so we're at this route. But we can't get over there without cut, so we can't get a Pokemon there. Because we're looking for a Pokemon that can learn cut. And if we have to cut to get through there, you see my problem. I think you all understand the mechanics and the issue that we're facing here. Let's just bite this thing. Possible level 54. We got a little berry boy over here. We got a little berry boy, everyone. Psyduck's a little berry boy. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Ah, I want a level 54. <clears throat> we'll get it next battle. All right, but this is a new route, which means a new opportunity. Why are there so many fucking trainers? I should go to Rock Tunnel to get myself an Onyx. Who the fuck wants an Onyx on their team? Do you just not want to ever be good? Do you want to never be considered a good Pokemon trainer? Because that's what happens if you get an Onyx on your team. All right, level 54. Oh my god, and it was a crit. No one survived in that. You know what? Let's give uh, Big Snake some, some time to shine. I know it can definitely one-hit KO a level 29 Graveler. See? And now we're gonna get level 42 before this battle's over. Because we'll just keep Big Snake in. survived. I survived my inability to drink fluids. Alright, level 42. Everything's good. I'm fine. Ooh, a golem? You've got a golem and you still want an onyx on your team? How embarrassing. Put more effort towards your golem. That's what you should be doing. Even though, competitively, Golem's not really that good either. <laughs> Alright, I see you, creepy old man. I'm just... I'm just checking out the area. Traversing the region. There's so many battles! Bow down before your regal Pokemon? You got some fucking arrogance on ya. You're gonna display that right in front of your child? And now I have to just fucking wreck you? Right in front of your kids? This is your fault. This is your fault. You're gonna have to look your child in the eye and tell them that you are a failure because of the way that you just talk shit to a 10-year-old girl.
Pokey fan Alex. This is the first Slow King that we've seen. That's kind of cool. <coughs> Shit, it survived. But it flinched. Oh, it's a little berry boy. I don't know why I'm saying that. I don't know where that came from. It's just kind of funny when you're battling like at this level. And they're like, oh yeah? You think you're going to beat me? Well, here's 10 more HP you got to knock off. Like, yeah, I'm not scared. Thunder Punch to the face. Whipping this Seeking all over the place. Alright, and then we'll face this creepy old man. Ah, oh, you have a Pikachu gang? That's fine, Cube can wreck through it. Six? You have six Pikachu? Is that really necessary? Wouldn't it make more sense to just have one really strong Pikachu than six weak ones? Alright, let's go cube! Can a boomerang kill a Pikachu? of this low level? It can. Cool, so we don't have to use the rest of our earthquakes. Because I don't know how close or far we are from the next town. This has definitely been the longest uh, journey in between towns so far. Forty-two. Three more Pikachus to go. <clears throat> All right, two more Pikachus. It's not even like this is challenging. It's just time consuming. You don't get much experience from these little things. These little level 23 Pikachus. Like 400. That's not a, that's not how we get these quick levels. Eh. There we go. There we go. All right, we gotta be close, right? There can't be too many more trainers. Sick, I think this is it then. We'll battle these kids. We can't use cuts, so we can't get, oh, there's, don't tell me there's gonna be two of them. I don't wanna battle two more. I just wanna get to the next town. <laughs> Ooh, Farfetch, so cool. That wasn't sarcasm. I think Farfetch are really cool. Ash is Farfetched. Mm. Oh my God! Pokemon Journeys new part comes out tomorrow, guys. Oh, I'm so excited! I'm gonna binge the whole thing this weekend. And by this weekend, I mean probably tomorrow.
All right, at least this really does seem like it's it. This has got to be the last trainer in this area. And then we'll be on to the next town. Hi, Sophia. Welcome back. How's your day been? We're doing good. We're just wrecking through Kanto right now. We still haven't lost any Pokemon. Um, we're just going around off Kanto right now. Battling all the trainers. And then we're going to do a gym leader gauntlet where we just go through all eight gyms at once. If we can do that. And then we're going to face Red. And try to win the game. Come on. I don't have cut. I don't want to face anyone else. <laughs> What's most important in our everyday lives? I don't know. That's how he talks. Just accept it, guys. Fisher Barney? Dude's a fucking hoss. But also this Thunder Punch is gonna absolutely kill seven of these things. If there were seven level 30 Gyaradoses in a line, and Dragonite throws a critical hit Thunder Punch, that is going so fast through that first Gyarados's face that it is hitting the next six behind it and killing every last one of them. Ultra kill, exactly. That's what we'd be getting. A super duper ultra kill. It is good experience. Good EXP to kill some level 30 Gyarados. Like dropping a bug zapper to catch fish. Exactly. Using a taser on the, po on the pond and just... Alright, there we go. Dragon Ball is almost at level 60. This is good. We're in a good spot. Simpsons movie reference? Oh, yeah. That does happen in the Simpsons movie, huh? I'm the fishing guru. Is the other brother? I don't care. <coughs> sure, I love fishing. Wow, a super rod? Thank you so much. I will literally never use it. I love how Green Day is in it. I don't like pronouncing that bad name because Beerfish always makes fun of the way I pronounce them. And so I'm afraid to say it, especially the fact that I just did. I don't know how I pronounce them, but he makes fun of me for it. Route 11? That's a different route. That's a new area. Why am I not on my bike? Okay, where is a town? For the love of God. <laughs> I don't remember Kanto being this large, guys. Oh, because that Snorlax is blocking the way, so I'm going the long way around. Isn't that what's happening? But I fought like 700 trainers since the last Poke Center. I'm running out of power points. <clears throat> Sleeping? My dad's basically Snorlax. He sleeps a lot. I think there's a little bit of Snorlax in everybody. I think Snorlax is a Pokemon we can all relate to. Stop, I just want to go to a town. Do you remember? I know that's not the words. 
That's me after a long day of collage. After you collage all day. Putting all those pictures together. Gets all tiring. <laughs> college you mean? I know. I know you meant college. But also, maybe pay a little more attention in your English classes. <sighs> you will? Good, good. I appreciate, I appreciate you taking my sage advice to, to heart. Boom, baby! After coming out, you feel more strong? That's how it works. It's a very empowering thing to do. Makes you feel like a whole new person, like you can take on the world. Getting a new haircut soon, too? Same. Not really. I'm not getting a haircut. I'm just getting the pink redone. It's starting to get a little blonde. It needs to be more pink. Also, my bangs are just long as shit now, and I would like to manage those a little better. Oh my god, we finally made it! I forgot how spooky Lavender Town's music is. Alright, there we go, Pokemon are all healed. Yeah, that's spoopy. We need a couple of Ultra Balls. I think we only have like four. We only have Great Balls? Fuck you guys. Soul House? Made the house? Huh? I don't remember this. Wasn't this a tower in the first game? Wasn't it this? What's this fucking massive building then? Interesting. Okay, well we've almost made it everywhere. <laughs> Not almost, but yeah, we're doing good. On their Cerulean City, so wait. Oh, I haven't gone to Cerulean yet. Because that way was cut off. Okay. So we're going to keep going up and around? Trainers everywhere. Quagsire. That's a fun little Pokemon. This thing actually, like, is a, a hard counter to a Dragonite. Because Fly is... Flying type's not effective. I don't think any of my moves are effective against this thing. So we're just gonna pray Brute Strength does the trick, and it does. I don't know what Koga was talking about. Brute Strength seems to be working pretty well right now. Alright, another fucking battle. <clears throat> That's it. She walks up to you. Ha 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 ha. Pokey battle. At least they only have one Pokemon. Damn, good for you. Good for you. It's a shame I gotta wreck it, but good for you. You earned that, Machamp. 
Gym boy? Hell yeah, my champs are fucking swole. So much experience. That's great. Like Arnold, but a Pokemon? Pretty much. That is Machamp. Is this dark, though? Is this a dark cave? This is fucking butts. I'm not going through a dark cave. So there's gotta be a way to get to Cerulean City without going through the dark cave. Cause I refuse to believe that they'd make you do that this late into the game. Maybe we do have to start collecting some gym badges. I thought that you could just do it in whatever order you wanted. But I guess we'll see. <clears throat> we'll keep heading this way and we'll see what's over here. If not, I guess we'll just go back and start collecting some of the gym badges. But I'd like to just go to all eight towns so that I can just fly one at a time to each town and just take out the gym leaders all in a row. That sounds more fun to me. Not a problem. Cut. Everything's cut. Why do we need cut to get everywhere in Kanto? I guess we could just replace Slash with cut. We barely use Slash in the first place. Why don't you surf? I don't know, because Grimer looks gross. It looks like something you kind of just wash away. It's jelly? No, it's sludge. It is waste. It can get earthquaked by cube. Radiation? Um, I don't remember... I don't remember exactly how Muck and Grimer... I don't remember their exact origin. But it's something like their toxic waste. Interesting? Yeah. There's all sorts of Pokemon lore. They all come from somewhere. Really? Oh, sick. the Kanto Pokemon Federation trainer group. We'll drive you under our wheels. Okay. I guess I'll wreck these cheap Pokemon. But it's nice. There's a town right here. This is a new town. Biker Dwayne. And they're fucking coughing. I hate this. All these bikers are assholes that just try to self-destruct all your well-earned Pokemon. Stop using Surf. <laughs> I'm just like hitting the first move and then I forget that Dragonite's a physical attacker, and so we shouldn't be using our special attack. It still kills it, no probs. Alright, let's go cube. Let's just use some earthquakes. Except I do think Boomerang would be strong enough. I have two more trainers I have to worry about. I have seven earthquakes. I'll just keep using Earthquake till I'm worried about it. Even though I do think Boomerang could do the trick now. <coughs> With it being super effective and the level difference. Mm. 
Yeah, let's just try Boomerang. I know we can take a self-destruct as long as it's not a crit. Let's go! These bikers and their coughing don't scare me none! Forty-three. Let us go, 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 go. All right. So let's just throw Cube in the front because it's probably going to be all po poison types because these bikers are assholes. The cops shot down our underground path. That really fries me. Shut up. You have a stupid voice. <laughs> okay, a Flareon. <coughs> Still can't survive an earthquake. Oh, this coffee's bitter. I don't know which one I took, but it's definitely a bitter one. It's cold. It does not taste good anymore. Ew, that tastes like butt. Oh, that's all he had? Alright. So we're about to take out the entire Kanto whatever federation of biker douches. I don't remember what they're called, but... And we will be at the next town. Here we go. And there we go. Just like that, the biker gang has been dealt with. Oh, we're not at the next town? This is just a building? Oh, it's the other side of the underground? Okay. But there's a town here. Wait, where are we already at, Seth? Do we just go in a fucking circle? I have to go through that cave. Unless I can go up from here? Why wasn't I able to? Did I even try? No, that's not it. That's the subway. daycare center. Okay, here's Cerulean City. This is a daycare center. This is a new area. Will this be a Pokemon that can learn? How is it another Abra? What were the chances of that? Damn! <clears throat> Alright, daycare center. Huh? Is this not the daycare center anymore? Is it really just only the one? I thought Kanto would have a daycare center. Damn it! Right, it's Cerulean City.
so this is an area. And yeah, then wait, how do we get to... Pewter City? Interesting, I don't know how to get to Pewter City. Oh, I have to use Surf. So first I have to get to... Oh, I've been to Fuchsia City, and then I gotta Surf down to Cinnabar, and then Surf up. Looks like that's gonna be what we have to do. All right, well, let's see. Let's see if this is a Pokemon that can learn Cut. Can Sparrow learn Cut? Sparrow learn set, Gen 2. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> Alright, well, let's heal up and then we'll go to that gym and we'll use Dragonite to just Thunder Punch everyone but Misty. And then we'll save Misty for when we do our gauntlet. Which we're getting close to. We've almost been to every single town. I think we just need to go down to Seafoam. Cinnabar, I mean. Go down to Cinnabar Island and then go up and get to Pewter. And then we will take on all the gym leaders. There's no one here. What? The p, -p police Everyone, toss your stash. What? Oh. Okay. I don't care. God, we could have gotten here so much quicker if we would have just had cut. <laughs> Alright, so let's head on up the cape. Let's see what's this away. New route! Okay, so this is route 24. And then slightly up is route 25. Okay. Let's see what we can get at route 24. Patter, patter key? <laughs> I almost said patter key. Caterpie learns such a. I doubt it. I really doubt Caterpie can. Yeah, I figured. It's a Caterpie. Ah, trainers! Beat the six of us to win a fabulous prize. So it's like the thing that they had in the previous game, but the bridge, instead of doing it at the bridge, they do it right after the bridge? Okay. Oddish. A level 35 Oddish. Sounds like something Epona could take care of. And it is. 
is! It is something Epona can take care of! Hopefully they all just have one Pokemon. Nice, quick, easy. That'd be cool, right guys? <clears throat> Can you kill with an earthquake? Snorble. I miss Snorble, guys. All right, no paralyze. We do too. Yeah, there's just, you know, some angels I miss more than others. Snorble's probably number one. Which is crazy, because I didn't want it at first. When it was a Snubble, I was mad that we encountered that thing. And it became my, my favorite angel at the moment. Hopefully for good. That'd be nice if we get no more angels. Pona. Blast it with your fire. Not a mega drain. Yeah, way to go, fire horse. There we go, level 44. See, I feel so much more conf confident taking on Lieutenant Surge. A Vaporeon. So our best bet is to just Thunder Punch it. It's a back-to-back -back battle. Four, five, and six. Okay, perfect. I did prefer it when they when they only had one Pokemon, like that first trainer. I was holding a paralyzed Cureberry. This whole time I thought I had a poison Cureberry on Epona and it was a paralyzed Cure. Oh, I'm so stupid. Good thing it didn't matter. <laughs> Good thing we didn't need that versus Koga. Let's ice punch it. Let's throw a f icy fist of fury at this Pidgey Oto. Yeah, 
Hindi ba lasam? Let's just send a pony back in. There we go. As expected. Yes, one Pokemon. Thank God Double Kick does nothing. God, Cube is very slow. The level 34 Nido King is faster. That is a slow Pokemon. Wait, is this a different area? Yeah, because we... But, so we have it... Okay. So we could go in that little grassy area and look and see. But let's face the six... Trainer real quick? Alright, we are out of Fire Blasts, so we'll just send in Dragon Ball and use Fire Punch. You're a butthole. You're a meanie doo-doo face. God, I might not be allowed to say that word. Really? It's just gonna be another Paris? Okay. Okay. Alrighty. And a p p p p parasect. <clears throat> I'll just use another fire p p p p punch. All right, there we go. I still have antidote, so I'll just heal it right here. Damn it. Just please don't be powerful. Please don't be powerful. Please don't be powerful. Okay. We're good. Cube's got this. As promised, you win a prize. A nugget. Okay. Uh, let's see. What am I going to drop? What am I going to drop? What am I going to drop? Let's just drop this potion. <laughs> he gave you a dank nug. Hi, Sky. How's it going? And hell yeah, he did. 
You were gifted one dank nug. Alright, hopefully this is just like a regular trainer. It isn't... You know, it seems like regular trainer. Just hopefully it's not strong. Because I'm not prepared for a battle. Like a difficult one. That's fine. That's actually totally fine. Because so we'll just throw in water, boy. And we'll just punch it in the face with some ice. Are you what surf is more effective? We can one hit KO it with either one, I assume, but let's just use Sir. A war turtle? A turtle of the wars? We will hit it with a punch of thunder. And then Charmeleon. Let's throw cube back in. Use an earthquake. Okay, we still hit it. We still be good, yo. And we got it. This is Bill's house. You're Bill's grandfather. I don't have a lick of tongue. Sorry, creepy grandpa. Sorry I couldn't bend more help to ya. That's it? I did all that for nothing? Alright, well let's... It is a different route, so let's encounter the Pokemon over here in this grass. And see if we can finally get a G-Dang Pokemon that knows Cut. I know a Caterpie can't, I just want to make sure Metapods can't either. Yeah. Such a disappointment that we cannot find one Pokemon that can learn Cut. So how do we get Misty to come back? And how do we get... Oh, I know how we get to Pewter City. I already knew that part. Alright, so we're gonna fly to Fuchsia City and then we'll surf down to Cinnabar Island. And then we'll go to Pewter City. And then we've been everywhere in Kanto, so we can just fly our way to all the gems. And then we'll take on the gym leaders, and then we'll take on Red. I do think we're finishing this today, guys. I really do. But before we continue, I am going to go pee. I will be right back, everybody.